I'm John Maddox with another episode of Investigative Guy. Ooh, a hand trying to block our camera. Well, that's just what happens when you bust a rental car company over their hidden fees. But we'll get back to the guy trying to block our camera. Here's where it all began. In the last few months, we've been getting reports that Dollar Rent-A-Car has been taking customers for a ride. Consumers say Dollar's found a new way to make a buck by charging customers a fee when they return the car without a receipt for the gas, even if the tank's totally full. Consumers say the fee's hidden and is never fully explained at the time of rental. So we went in undercover to investigate if there is such a fee and what indeed is disclosed to renters about it. We saw lots of hustles, but the agents never said how much the penalty would be if you return without a receipt. All we could find was a sign that said, quote, please have your fuel receipt at the end of your rental to avoid fuel charges. Huh? Whatever that's supposed to mean. Okay, thank you. Well, we got our car and drove around. Then we went and got gas, right across the street from Dollar. There, we filled it. And I mean, really filled it. Yes, so full it splashed all over. And just to be doubly sure we filled it, we carried more in a gas can. So I'm on the road tonight, baby I'm Which we poured in 50 yards down the road from the Dollar entrance. Splashing all over me. Then we returned the car. And as we checked in, I made sure they knew I filled it. The, top fell off. the attendant checked the gauge and checked on the form we filled it. But then the question. And do you have a gas receipt? So despite the tank being totally filled. Uh, I just back. bought it right over there. Just filled it up two minutes ago. Which he had already checked off. Bingo! He hits us with a hidden charge customers have been complaining about. If you don't have your gas receipt, you can get charged up to one gallon in gas. One gallon in gas, you can charge me? Basically. Okay. And it's based on the miles you drove. You only drove 14 miles. Right. And uh, the, the computer is charging you $6.99. $6.99. That's correct. Okay. Let's hear that again so you don't miss it. If you don't have your gas receipt, you can get charged. And it's based on the miles you drove. $6.99. $6.99. Then he realized we had it all on hidden camera. What is he doing? He's recording this. Is there any way he can stop recording? No, we're in a public place. Well, he walked off leaving us with our bill. But we wanted to give Dollar a chance to explain the hidden charge. So we went back in to talk to the manager. How you doing? I'm John Mattis with investigativeguy.com. How you been? All he wanted to do was shut us down. Can you get our, the camera down for me? Can we get a comment about on the what? hidden charge, about the gasoline charge, can even you if I- the camera down? Well, can no, we, I'd like it on the record. Ooh, he then threw us out. Can you please the property sir? And no comment. So you have no comment on no the, comment the hidden all. gas charge, no even though the gas tank's full. I have, I have no comment, sir. So people are sir, getting these hidden charges sir, no matter I have what. No comment. Can you exit the property? So people are just going to get stiff. So all these consumers in there, you're not going to tell them. Have a nice day, John Mattis, InvestigativeGuy.com. Now, if you've been scammed by this hidden fee charge. Let us know at Investigative Guy, because I've got your back.